vacant units are all in various stages of renovation. So it's up to you how much or how little you wanna put into it. But if you were to put $500,000 into this building, you would still leave with a 10% return. That's huge. For example, some units have luxury vinyl plank flooring and some don't. And then some units have updated cabinetry and stainless steel appliances. And some don't. And then some even have mold. But what they all have in common is they're all two stories, one and a half bathrooms, original hardwood floors on the second floor, and have entrance to an outside patio. That needs a little work, but that's kind of the theme we have going here, right? Look, I get it. Cleveland Heights can be scary because of its point of sale, and it is kind of intense. But you're renovating everything anyway, so anything they would know, you're gonna be fixing. Townhome style units aren't common, and most of the mechanicals are newer. This is not going to last, so if you want more information on this apartment or any other apartment in Northeast Ohio, my name's Erin Thomas, and you should contact me below.